Hello, this is Rem. Welcome to my rendition of Magnets from Simon Tan and the Puzzles. I'll go ahead and show you how to play today. Alright, so in Magnets, the top left shows the positive sign, so the top means how many positives there are. You can't have a positive next to a positive, they oppose. And then the negative at the bottom right shows that the two above it and the bottom floor are all the negative amounts in those columns. And so, the zero shows there's zero positives. So if there's anything vertical, like this one, there can't be a positive there, and so there, there can't be a magnet there at all. Let's go ahead and uh, focus on this one at the top left. With a three, all the positives have to be separated, and so all of our positives line up like this. The bottom floor shows there's one negative in this column. All right, that one's already filled up. That one's complete. So we know that this is going to have a green x in between them it's like separates the magnets it's part of the solution um so we're going to be filling in a lot of them with them like at the top left we have a one so there's one positive and it's complete so we know there's going to be a green x right here all right and then at the bottom towards the right there's the two we see that there's going to be two negatives um, the first one is on the left already. There's going to have to be a positive next to that. We can't put another negative over there. So we know there's going to be another negative on the right. So we'll put down a question mark. And on this left side, we know at the bottom left there's a 1. Because the negative 1 is, uh, the negative is already, or the positive is already in place. There can't be another uh, magnet on the left. And because of the question mark box, there's going to be another positive there. So... We can't have a, this green box takes care of that one. And there's going to be another green box on the bottom right because of that positive. It's already there. So on the left, we have a bottom, we have a two. So there's going to be two negatives. We can't have two negatives next to each other, so that one goes there. And then on the right, we have the two positives and one negative. So it just kind of fills in for itself, and that's it. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this rendition of Magnets.